Hello everyone, my name is Said Bari. I am a PhD student at CEPES Virginia Tech. Today I am going to introduce you a new constant on time current mode control using inverse charge control concept and also show that how it can improve the noise performance in VR controls. Today constant on time control is widely used in the industry for better light load efficiency and high bandwidth design capability. In multiphase operation, pulse distribution method is popular because of its simple interleaving process. But one major issue of this method is the ripple cancellation effect, what we can see in the middle that inductor current ripple is becoming smaller and smaller with the increase of the duty cycle. So when the duty cycle is small, then the inductor current ripple is large, no issue. But when the in induct uh, duty cycle start be, uh, increasing then the ripple of the inductor current becoming smaller and become more noise sensitive which actually creates jittering at the output and the duty cycle and when duty cycle increase more then at some point ripple becomes zero and there the whole control fails to operate so it cannot work in that ripple cancellation point now when the phase number increases in multiphase operation that actually creates more ripple cancellation point and make the control uh, more difficult. So to solve this issue, we here we proposed uh, the inverse charge uh, control constant on time here. Uh, in the left we can see the conventional constant on time current mode control where inductor current and VC uh, create the duty cycle. In the proposed IQCOT, instead of the VC and inductor current ripple, we use the difference to charge the cap to generate the duty cycle. In this page, we show that how the proposed IQCOT solves this noise sensitivity and ripple cancellation issue. So, here we can see when uh, the D equals to 0.21 for four phase operation when the ripple is small, but still in the I ramp, we have enough DC to charge the cap and to generate the duty cycle. And here, when you increase the duty cycle more, the duty cycle 0 0.25 for four phase, we can see that there is no ripple at all, but the DC of the IRAM still generates the VRAM to create the duty cycle. So we can say that the proposed IQCOT control can improve the noise sensitivity when the ripple is small and also can operate and the ripple cancellation point where ripple is completely zero. Here we are trying to show the IQCOT control with a con uh, commercial VR controller. So this is a VR controller evolution board from Texas Instrument 59650. And this is an experimental board where we try to implement our proposed IQCOT control. And using the two-phase GPU uh, power stage, we try to show the transient and noise performance improvement by the proposed control. Here we are showing the proposed IQ CAT control with two-phase operation. You can see here the two-phase operation is uh, working in the almost 50% duty cycle which is very close to the ripple cancellation point. So the two-phase inductor current is showing here and you can see the summation of this two phase current i sum is very small so whenever the ripple is also very small it is still working properly and you can see the v out is regulating quite well that's all from me today thank you very much for watching